All right, guys, uh, just a quick video here um, and an update about Rookie. Um, first, I really want to thank everyone who sent well wishes to me either uh, through YouTube or Facebook or personally uh, regarding his health. Um, I really can't tell you how much that means to me. He's doing well. Had a great checkup today at the vet. Um, and fingers crossed um, with his next checkup, uh, next Wednesday, just to make sure he doesn't have uh, anything lingering, um, I should be able to go to the show. I'm feeling very optimistic about how he's progressing, and um, again, I really can't thank you guys enough for uh, the support that you've uh, given me. I think he's still sitting there. Yep, there he is with his cone on his head. Rookie! He's not going to look. He doesn't really respond to his name, but there he is with his cone. He's chilling. Um, you can kind of see that his belly is shaved from the incision, but uh, there he is. Anyway, back to cards. Um, so on the right here, um, this was a card that I picked up. Both cards I, I picked up and paid for before his uh, before surgery. Um, this card came last week from Probstein Auction. Um, this is, I think, now my three and a half, third and a half double play of this of this version of the, of the dull play card. Um, I have one of just the Greenberg side um, without the red roughing attached to it. This is a five, as you can see. Um, I picked up that uh, that raw card from the National last year, which I had graded, and it came back a seven. Um, so this is a nice one to add under 100 bucks. And it's really not my favorite card and not his most valuable card, but I really thought the centering was very nice. It's a little off left to right, but kind of hard to find these cards uh, in nice shape. People, I think, beat them up. Um, so in the, mid, in the mid to high grades, they're uh, a little hard to come by. I thought this was a deal, so I, I grabbed that one. Uh, back is blank, nothing to really see there. Uh, this one arrived today from Heritage. Um, this is a 1936 Gaudi in a seven, um, and uh, freshly graded by SGC, um, but the card is very, very sharp here. Um, I have, this is now my fourth 36 Gaudi, I believe. Uh, one autographed, a four, and a four and a half, now a seven. Uh, very happy to grab this card. Um, you really don't see these uh, in grades and looking as, as clean as this one does. Uh, I'm gonna turn it over so you can see the back. Um, all of these have um, a variety of different sayings and outcomes I think Gaudi kind of intended it for a game to be played here, but I don't really know how they would do it. Maybe they would flip their f or spin the card in such a way. Um, but uh, I love the language that they use here. Um, it's just really funny. Um, but really, really happy with this card. Um, really such a nice example of a 36 Gaudi. And um, I like his action poses better than his portraits, but um, I happen to like this black and white 36 Gaudi a lot, and uh, presents well in the, uh, in the new SGC slab. Well guys, thanks for watching again. Rookie is still, no, he's, no, he's, he's gone. <laughs> um, but again, thank you for the well wishes about Rookie, uh, it means a lot to me, and um, if all goes well again, we will, uh, we'll see you in Chicago. Oh, here he is. There he is. Rookie with a shaved tummy. Bye, guys. See you later.